in this video we have given that 1 by a plus 1 by b plus c is equal to 1 by 2 and 1 by b plus 1 by c plus a is equal to 1 by 3 and 1 by c plus 1 by a plus b is equal to 1 by 4 and we have to find the value of a b and c so here the first equation is 1 by a plus 1 by b plus c is equal to 1 by 2 and now we can get a times b plus c will be a b plus c a and here we get b plus c plus a that will be a plus b plus c is equal to 1 by 2 or we can get a b plus c a by a plus b plus c is equal to 2 and the second equation is 1 by b plus 1 by c plus a is equal to 1 by 3 and now b times c plus a will be b c plus a b and c plus a plus b will be a plus b plus c is equal to 1 by 3 or we can get b c plus a b by a plus b plus c is equal to 3 and the third equation is 1 by c plus 1 by a plus b is equal to 1 by 4 or we can get c times a plus b will be c a plus b c and a plus b plus c is a plus b plus c is equal to 1 by 4 or we can get c a plus b c by a plus b plus c is equal to 4 and now we have to find the value of a b and c so if we call this equation as equation 1 this as equation 2 and this as equation 3 and now if we add equation 1 equation 2 and equation 3 i mean equation 1 plus equation 2 plus equation 3 then a b is 2 times and c a is also 2 times and b c is also 2 times so we get 2 times a b plus b c plus c a by a plus b plus c is equal to 2 plus 3 plus 4 will be 9 and let's call this as equation 4 and now if we subtract 2 times equation 1 from equation 4 I mean equation 4 minus 2 times equation 1 then 2ab and 2ca will get cancelled and we get 2 times bc by a plus b plus c is equal to 9 minus 4 will be 5 and if we subtract 2 times equation 2 from equation 4 equation 4 minus 2 times equation 1 then 2 times bc and 2 times ab we get cancelled and we get 2 times ca by a plus b plus c is equal to 9 minus 6 will be 3 and if we subtract 2 times equation 3 from equation 4 equation 4 minus 2 times equation 3 here we have equation 2 then 2 times c a and 2 times b c we get cancelled and we get 2 times a b by a plus b plus c is equal to 9 minus 8 will be 1 and now let's call this as equation 5 this as equation 6 and this as equation 7 and now we have to find the value of a b and c 
so if we divide equation 5 by equation 6 if we divide equation 5 by equation 6 then 2c by a plus b plus c and 2c by a plus b plus c when you get cancelled and we get b by a is equal to 5 by 3 or we get b is equal to 5 by 3 times a and if we divide equation 5 by equation 7 equation 5 divided by equation 7 then 2b by a plus b plus c and 2b by a plus b plus c when you get cancelled and we get c by a is equal to 5 by 1 when b 5 or c is equal to 5 times a and now the equation 5 is 2bc by a plus b plus c is equal to 5 equation 5 is 2bc by a plus b plus c is equal to 5 and now we get 2 times b is equal to 5 by 3a b is 5 by 3a and c is 5a by a plus b is 5 by 3 times a plus c is 5a is equal to 5 or 2 into 5 into 5 will be 50 by 3 times a square by a plus 5a will be 6a and 6a plus 5 by 3a will be 23 by 3a is equal to 5 and now 3 and 3 when you get cancelled and 1a and 1a when you get cancelled and we get 50 by 23 times a is equal to 5 or a is equal to 5 times 23 by 50 and 5 times 10 is 50 so we get a is equal to 23 by 10 and now we have b is equal to 5 by 3a and c is equal to 5a we have b is equal to 5 by 3a and c is equal to 5a so b will be 5 by 3 into a is 23 by 10 a is 23 by 10 and 5 times 2 is 10 so we get b is equal to 23 by 6 and c will be 5 times 23 by 10 and 5 times 2 is 10 so we get c is equal to 23 by 2 so the value of a is 23 by 10 and b is 23 by 6 and c is 23 by 2